Welcome! In this video I will tell you about 5 hidden tricks you may have not known about on your Honor X7D. A quick disclaimer, there will not be any uh, AI tricks because we have a separate video on our YouTube channel titled uh, 5 Hidden AI Tricks You Didn't Know About. Uh, so if you want to learn more about AI features on your phone, then go ahead and check that video out. You are highly welcome. Uh, now the first uh, trick I wanted to show with, uh, with you, to you is the double tap to wake and sleep and also raise to wake feature, which you can access in settings. Uh, if you scroll all the way down to accessibility features uh, and go to shortcut and gestures and then select uh, screen on slash off, you'll be able to enable all of these three features and uh, then you'll be able to double tap your home screen in order to put your device to sleep and double tap it again to wake it up or instead you can just grab your phone with your hand and it will also wake up itself. Now the next hidden feature I wanted to tell you about is the magic portal with knuckle gestures. So uh, just draw a circle with your knuckle on your screen uh, to select an element and it will enable the magic portal. Now what the magic portal is, it is a smart on-screen uh, on tool that lets you quickly grab text to translate uh, or search items on the screen without switching applications. You can either uh, draw a shape with a knuckle or you can uh, hold your finger down on the photo and drag it to the side of the window or you can also uh, select a test text and then hold your finger down on it and also drag, drag it to the side of the window. And so uh, the features I, that it serves, serves for I mentioned a previously. Okay, so the next thing that you can, uh, the, uh, the next feature I wanted to show you is the AI button customization. So press the AI button on your phone, which is located on the left edge of your device, and then uh, tap the gear icon. Well, don't tap the gear icon if you're entering it for the first time. I will actually uh, do that because because I didn't prepare properly for the video. So you can add five uh, custom applications to your shortcut button by tapping open apps right here and adding uh, some of the applications from this list uh, for quick access. Uh, now you can also add more applications uh, by tapping the gear icon right here and then tapping this icon to add a new app or uh, remove an app with an X icon right here. And this way you can uh, have access to five custom applications uh, using a shortcut on your smartphone. And the next feature I wanted to show you is the app twin feature, which once again is available in settings. If you go to the apps section uh, and go to the app twin, you'll be able to enable uh, a twin for any social media application or basically the uh, your the application that your phone recognizes as your social media as a social media uh, app because it requires a login. Uh, so if you switch the toggle next to one of these applications, it will create a copy of this app and will put it on your home screen. And this way, you'll be able to use two different accounts uh, in the same on the on the same phone in this app. And the last thing I wanted to share with you is. Uh, floating windows for multitasking. If you want to enable the floating windows feature, you have to go to accessibility features in the settings and go to multi-window and switch this toggle to the right. And then just swipe your finger uh, from the side of your phone to enable this bar with uh, quick apps. You can also open more apps. And so uh, once you select an app, it will enable itself in a window that is adjustable and you can also add more windows if you want to. So basically you can have an app and still navigate uh, navigate on your phone. And that's that's a really great uh, feature if you want multi multitasking. And basically, the app will stay here uh, until you until until you you will 
put it uh, to this trash bin icon. And that's all the feature I wanted to share with you today. So thank you so much for watching this video. If it's helped you, please consider subscribing to our channel. Leave us a like and a comment below. And I'll see you in the next one.